What's up Giants fam? Welcome back to the channel for yet another graffiti video. You're probably all wondering, what is this dude doing with a baby dumpster on his desk? Big shout out to my coworker, Rolando Tapia. He commissioned me to paint this desktop garbage can for him. It's actually super cool. I'd never seen one of these before. If you're wondering where you can get one for yourself, these things are like 200 bucks on dumpsy.com and it's legit a little dumpster. It's like straight up made out of some hard steel. It's got some good wheels on it. All the makings and details of an actual dumpster even got a lid. So we're gonna paint his last name here and his daughter's names on the sides. And um, I'm gonna do my best to really just tech it out, make it look like a graffiti, like tagged up dumpster. To help me accomplish this, what I'm gonna use is you can see I got this really nice Arteza bag. No, I am not sponsored by them, so this is not an endorsement. This isn't a sponsored ad. I actually was on the hunt for a really good marker bag. I actually found this on Amazon. I'll put the link in the description below. I really love this Arteza bag because it houses all 72 of my Molotov oil-based paint markers and it breaks out in this, it opens in this very like neat way. And the middle slot actually comes out. So you can open it and you have all your markers right here for you. Nice, easy, efficient. But yeah, so what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna use these Molotov One For All oil-based paint markers uh, to help me accomplish this little mini dumpster project. I've been doing graffiti art for, you know, 10 plus years. I've used about every paint marker there is on the market from Sharpie to Deco to Unis to Molotov to everything, these are the best ones. So I'll also put in the link, a description for these as well um, in the description below. But yeah, anyways, without further ado, let's get to it. Little update, the paint markers are going onto the metal well, but it's taking me a little bit longer than I expected. Um, to get the fill in to a nice solid point like this, how it is now, it took me three coats. That means I had to go in, lay down down once, lay down another coat, wait for it to dry, lay down another coat. So it was a little unexpected for me. I thought I was gonna be able to move through this a lot faster. So I gotta change my game plan a little bit because I'm also going to do two little pieces on this side. No, one here and one here. Now that I know that it's taken me a little bit longer to get a solid fill, what I'm going to do now is adjust my game plan a little. So I'm going to work on the side pieces now. Basically, I'm going to get all three sides of this dumpster to a fill in point, how it is here. That way tomorrow I could just go through, hit my outlines, hit some background details, and we'll call it done. We'll call it a wrap. All right, now that I got my fill-in done for all three of my bombs, now it's time to start outlining.
All right, so I'm really excited. I'm really happy because I finally got all three bombs done. We got Tapia, we got Zara, and we got Camila. Um, so what I'm gonna do right now is go around and just have fun and just tag up the whole bin in all these empty areas, like the lids, uh, the back, got an open spot right here. And what I'm basically gonna do is just go around, thrash it with some tags the way a real dumpster would be in real life to make it more realistic. All of the like hard work, the big work is now done. Let's go around, tag it up, throw it up, throw it up, throw it up, and just have fun, thrash it and wreck it. Beast Boy, what you doing? You always coming at the wrong time. Welcome to the end of the video. <laughs> Beast Boy, stop. <laughs> you always do this right when I start. But anyways, you made it to the end of the video. I hope you liked this video. I had a lot of fun um, painting this mini dumpster for my coworker and I'm really excited. I'm really stoked because I finally got it all done. Um, I mean, she looks pretty cool. I, I love how this whole thing came out. Got the black and white, grayscale throwies on the back, Zara right here in green, and all around it, I actually wrote like positive, good messages. Like right here in red says family. Um, all on the top says like honor, positive vibes, be good to others, be kind, joyful, truth, um, tranquility, be all this kind of like nice, positive messages. I think I'll actually maybe do a few more, or I'm thinking about purchasing a few doing them all up on my own like my own style completely customized and like putting them up for sale i don't know let me know what you think in the comment section below of doing more fun little videos like this and fun little items like little dumpsters little trash cans little trains i got little trains right here um little semi trucks little airplanes and just having fun making cool content cool graffiti art content um but yeah if you're liking our videos hit that like button drop a comment below and as always subscribe that goes a long way for us here at the channel that supports me as well a lot um but yeah thank you for tuning in and we'll see you in the next video peace